Thanks, too. I'm very happy. Uh -oh. What is this, Reach? This is, this is my favorite. You want the other side kiss? Okay. Yes, baby. How about I'll make it? Here, you guys. What, what is this? Thank you. What is it, Joy? Is that a meatball? In the, what is that? No, that's a blackberry. <laughs> no. That's a big what blackberry. What is this, you guys? Um, this is Regis's favorite dish at Bell Bella, his Did favorite you stop restaurant. By Bell you went to Bell Bella on the way here? We were yes. up at six. Yes. Why there? Wow. <laughs> Sit down, honey. You get them in this. It is rigatoni bolognese. Rigatoni bolognese. We order it every Saturday night. It's forgotten. Rigatoni bolognese. Now, where do yes. I go? You, you go I'm on the other side. Reed, you take the end there. Let's sit and chat for a second. It really is good. It's great oh, stuff. It's, you, it's one of those things where you can't stop eating. Val Bella is the greatest restaurant, like, ever. We went there. It was like sitting with the Godfather. <laughs> Reed is in the corner. You can see the whole room. They just kept bringing out tray after tray after tray of food. It was so delicious. Yeah, Every single dish. How do you feel dish. the next morning? I know, right? I was like, oh my God, I'm so full. So guilt we, we never went for Italian food because I love her food, but yeah, that was pretty, pretty oh, good. Yeah. Well, yeah. Well, yeah. Well, that's a great idea yeah. if you're going to somebody's house, bring a party off. It's yeah. really good. Well, thank you. Cheers. You know what? We'll get some Cheers. dishes. Cheers. Cheers. Oh my God, look at this. Look at that. Yeah. Prettier when it's on a beautiful plate. <laughs> we'll put them on some pretty plates over the break. Come on, cheers, guys. Thank, cheers. Thank you, sweetie. So, do you guys do a lot of entertaining at the house? No. Yes. <laughs> yes, we do. I guess I need to find in how much um, is a lot. <laughs> well, lately, you know, since, I don't know, Regis has started just saying, no, it's a lot of trouble, it's a lot of work. <laughs> but we used to entertain, well, we don't entertain in the city. Because yeah. I love my kitchen right, in right, Connecticut. Right. So you've got uh, and we do it there. most yeah. of the time, and you've been there. And, yeah, and most of the time, we we do it in the summertime because it's so much fun and so much nice. And you get extra outside. space because yes. people are in and out. Right. So um, Regis and I started out that way when we were first married. We used to have sit-down dinners in L.A. But now you shut it all down. Park. No, she's not allowed to anymore. Hey, tell them the truth. When I suggest a party, what do you say? Tell them the I truth. I say no. <laughs> so, uh, so you take Rachel know. and John? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, you guys are our favorites. Out in L.A., we, we lived there for a number of years, a long time. Well, we used to have big parties, nice parties. Sit down. Sit down. Oh, formal. Uh, because yeah. we had this. I'm sorry, honey. Go ahead. <laughs> no, we, we just had a lot of friends in our business, and yeah. so it was fun to, to, to be with them, uh, other than work with them. Right, you know? right, right. So I enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun. I what? had very bad experience, though, that uh, I, I was just going to say, what's the dinner party disaster? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't entertain for a long time after that. We had a formal dining room. It's, we had 10 people for a sit-down. And um, it never occurred to me in those days to have somebody help or do the cooking right, or sure, something. Do it I did it. Um, and everything was going so well, and it was time for dessert night, and there was a swinging door, you know, between oh, the kitchen. No. <laughs> um, so I went into the kitchen to get my cheesecake, which I had made, oh. in a springform pan. And I was a little bit, you know, rushed and stressed. You know how you yeah. are when you're entertaining. So I had taken it out of the pan, but left the bottom on it. And I put it on this beautiful pedestal cake plate. And I head for the door, push the door open, like, l remember Loretta Young, she goes through that door, and this thing took off like a Frisbee. Oh and it, it was embarrassing, don't we The metal bottom of it, like a Frisbee. Bottom. I mean, what was Regis I thinking? was embarrassed. <laughs> almost, Anyone get injured? Almost ended up in his lap, but fortunately it hit the floor, boom, and that was the end of the dessert, but everyone thought it was so funny. Yeah. No, but that's, that but we, that's a funny moment, yeah. Yeah, but stupid, right? To it, not take the bottom off? I don't know what it is. You know thinking. what? This is why I don't bake, Joy. You and just know bake? I don't like baking. It's too much of a science. I love to cook. If people say, what can I bring? I say dessert or I stop by the bakery. <laughs> That's Done. right. We've been to dinner at your house both times. You said, and I said, what can I bring? You said, bring Please dessert. bring dessert. <laughs> I, I actually begged Joy to bring <laughs> dessert. I'm so, so bad. Did you ever have a guest over, guys, that you were nervous about having over? The very first time we moved to New York and uh, we moved into an apartment house that had some height to it, you know, yeah, yeah. like on the 51st floor. And I was so proud. You've been there. Oh, yeah, yeah it's beautiful. Of the view. Amazing. Not of the apartments, but still the view. <laughs> the view. <laughs> you look out and you see all of New York, New Jersey, and the lights are flashing and everything. And so we had a party. And uh, the first one tonight, uh, uh, but that day, 
all of a sudden a fog moved in. I couldn't see anything. <laughs> you know, you ruined that my way, view. That was the party. That was the whole thing about the party. <laughs> Wait to see the view I got. You know? <laughs> what a robe I was. Uh, it was like somebody painted the windows white. Uh, That's well, all you could see. first guessed at the door. I said, who could it be? Because, I, you know what, I'm embarrassed. I shut my mouth on so much. <laughs> Wait to see the view I've got. <laughs> Open the door. Barbara Walters. <laughs> Many stops to make that night. Yeah, I said, Barbara, come on in. But let me tell you something. You know, all the time I've talked about this view, we can't see anything. It's all fog out there, Barbara. What am I going to do? <laughs> the first time Barbara's ever been stumped. That's right. <laughs> you, you stumped it, couldn't be, it was really embarrassing. But it still so was, that was, it was another fun big party. success. Yeah, another yeah. big success. Yeah. Oh my gosh, this smells so good. I think we have to get dishes. I think we should dish it yes. out. Yeah, we'll, we'll get some dishes. Everybody We're going to take a quick it. break. House party continues. I'm bringing in another one of my co hosts, Bill Bellamy, and his beautiful wife. We're going to meet her right after this. Tomorrow, five. Here at my home, away from home, we've got Reed Joy, my husband John. And now we're gonna bring out another one of my co-hosts for the season, and we're gonna finally get to meet his beautiful wife. Please welcome, for the first time together at our show, Bill and Kristen Bella. <laughs> Isn't that gorgeous? Yeah. Looks like oh, a little doll. It feels so good. Yeah. Hey, everybody. These are yeah. so cute. So, guys, they brought some bad bella pasta. You guys are right oh there. Gosh. You sit down. John, you guys some drinks? I cooked this myself. This is Regis' really favorite dish from uh, his favorite restaurant, Bell Bella. So, mm. that's what we brought. Isn't this very something? Bell Bella is so good. Yeah. Here we go. <laughs> what did you bring? These look awesome. So, those are pumpernickel toast, the one thing I can make, with cream cheese and crispy bacon and green olives. It's our Minnesota dish. Wow. Bacon and olives? Uh, yeah. <laughs> That's some combination down, right? you got there, Kristen. Okay. Yeah. Delicious. Delicious. Salt, you're good. <laughs> so, the way she slices it. Why do you call it the Minnesota? What's the story behind the dish? Well, my mom was not a great cook, but she did a couple <laughs> things, like chicken and dumplings and lasagna, and this was her appetizer. So my sister and I have been making this since we were very young, and it's just pumpernickel toast with cream cheese, crisp, crisp bacon, and green olives chopped on it, and we would serve these as appetizers for all we're holidays. We're going to make up another batch that. of that. I love that. Apple, oh, my God. God. <laughs> Showers. They're good for baby showers because women, like it is, women love the cheese and the bacon. The salt, salt. yeah. yeah. Mm. Listen, you guys have two little ones. Mm -hmm. How many times do you actually get to go out as grown-ups? Um, today. Today. <laughs> 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 no, I'm gonna have you on the show more often. Than what a beautiful family. Now. Oh. So sweet. Now we, we do, we're, you know what, they're seven and ten now, so we're going out more. When they're yeah. little, it's very hard. We didn't see a movie for two years, but now they're older. <laughs> and we actually have date night on Tuesdays because yeah. Bill's on the road on the weekend. So Tuesday, we're pretty sure he's going to be home. So it's date night. It's date night. And then, you know, we try to have, like, house parties during the holidays. Like, we used to do, like, what we used to do, like, Christmas Eve parties where we yeah, have yeah, adults yeah. over and then people invite friends or friends. Do you ever have that happen? No. No. <laughs> She's so serious <laughs> about the list. Like, you know, when we get the list, you say you got 75 people, and we always wind up with 100. Oh. Yeah. I always wanted to, like, sneak into one of your parties, Regis. You won't find 100 people there. <laughs> <laughs> Regis almost lost his Val Bella. <laughs> oh, you guys, okay, so our... our crack team here at the show. Thought it'd be fun if they did a little Q&A bowl. Okay. So everybody just take one, okay, to say we, we did this. It's a little get to know you bowl. We're scared. Is this like changing the keys? I have no idea. I certainly <laughs> hope not. <laughs> Whatever you pull out of here is a question, you gotta answer. You gotta answer. Okay, yeah, it's sort of like party truth or dare or something. All right, Reed, you start on your end. Why should Reed just start? <laughs> Why should Reed What's start? the one movie you'll always stop and watch when flipping through the channels? Oh, well, that's easy. That's, that's easy. Do you know the answer to that? I don't know. Let me just think. You know, I happen to love Harry Grant because there's nobody like Harry Grant ever has been or ever will be. That's right? true. Mm -hmm. So if I see him Harry Grant thing, whatever it is, 
I stop. stick with it, yeah. I agree, I always stop for it. What's that? Godfather? And Godfather. Oh, and oh, the Godfather, yeah. too. Yeah. You can't turn it off. No, you're right about that. Sure. Everybody stops for the Godfather. <laughs> yeah. Joy, what'd you get? What do you get, Joy? Let's hear this. <laughs> I got, what was it like the first time you met your spouse's family? Oh. <laughs> I gotta go now. Oh, did you know about this one? Because it's not my favorite, because this is a no-win oh. answer. Pick a different one. Well, Regis used to call his father the Sphinx, and I never understood it. Why? Until I met his father. father. Talk much, all right? a, man, a man of very few words, and when you're sitting down to dinner... Can I enjoy them, my... <laughs> and his mother, of course, Italian, and she's yeah. got those, you know, she had these great sparkly brown eyes, and she was very feisty. And she had no qualms about asking you the most personal <laughs> question. What did my mother ever ask I can't. Here? I'm not going to divulge now. <laughs> my poor sainted mother. Here we are talking about my mother. <laughs> <laughs> we ended up being good friends, except at the wedding, his father was the first one to say, well, we got to get rolling, and that was before dinner. And that was before... <laughs> That was before I said I do. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go, Bellamy. All right. What'd you get? What's uh, your most embarrassing moment? The first thing that comes to mind, I got to tell you this. We were invited to a dinner with uh, uh, President Clinton at the time. Mm -hmm. And it was like this big deal. And I was trying to impress her. And we were just You're like, dating, we're yeah. dating. You know, she's like, you going to take me to meet the president? So, <laughs> <laughs> and, we get, and we get to the house, and it's the wrong day. And we go, oh. It was just mansion in L.A. But we went one day early. We were dressed. We was like, ha! <laughs> and then I had to think about what the whole thing is. You plan an outfit for so far in advance. And then the so host saw me oh show up on Monday. I'm like, what am I going to wear tomorrow? I'm a It was horrible. It was horrible. It, the you ride home was, was worse, though. The they ride home. They were like, they, they were like, like, like we're crazy. No, they were like, they were like, they were like that's they tomorrow. We were like, what? What did you get, Kristen? Let's go. The favorite gift you've ever gotten. Oh. Well, he's a good gift giver, but I can't. I think um, my night nurse. Not romantic, but my one. first child, I was so scared. And yeah. so that's all I wanted was a night. And, he, and then I cried when she was going to leave after two weeks, so he let me have her for a month. Oh. So that was a very. The night nurse. That's it. Night nurse. Yeah, that's so you can see. That's night amazing. nurse, I mean, fellas. I was afraid. <laughs> You know, that's, that's exactly what I would like as a gift. A night nurse. <laughs> Hello? Come on Hello. in. <laughs> you know, like, I wouldn't mind that either. You're like, I'm going to make sure you get that. that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Honey, what do you got? If you could witness any event, past, present, or future, what would it be? Mm. Oh, well, intellectual. Huh, you know I'm a Jets fan. Yes! <laughs> Super Bowl three. Yes! 69, when they actually won. Just yeah. one year ago. Broadway Joe. Broadway really Joe. good one. I'll be there. Classic. What's the last white lie you told your spouse? Mm. <laughs> I don't know. Did you catch me one lately, honey? <laughs> well, no, you told me you liked what I was wearing. I don't know if you, you really look did. very oh, handsome. Thanks. We're very verbal people. I tell them everything We're straight up. Sicilian. Okay, we don't shopping. lie. Do you say every single thing, or do you say, oh, I've had this in my closet forever? Oh, like he cares. <laughs> <laughs> I bring what? him on bags of bags of stuff. He's like, honey, I don't need it. Take it back. I'm like, um, I didn't even open the box yet. Then I opened the box. He's like, I need it. I need it. Leave it here. <laughs> no, he's not like that. So I don't know. He's easy not to lie to. Oh, you're so sweet. Yes. Oh. We can tell you anything. Understand. Are you, well, you're going to get a yeah, nightmare. It sounds sweet. It's because we're going to make nightmare too. It's because we're yeah, usually screaming at each other. Out. Should we take another break? Because this is uncomfortable for me. <laughs> Let's keep drinking. I'm going to take a break. When we come back, Kristen's going to show us how to make them little toasty things after this. We have Joy, we have Bill, we have Kristen, my husband, John. Kristen, we are out of your toasts. We're down to one. Okay. So they're we have a little eating. setup. Why don't you show us how you put these together? I love it. I love it. Okay. So you were saying you don't cook a lot, but your sister is a great chef. Yes. My sister, Melissa, she's the chef, and I am the decor, the mixologist. Like, I, I do the liquor and the flowers and the table set. So basically, you take the pumpernickel or rye toast, and you spread the cream Rough cheese. I love I love this I, stuff. The little mini loaves. Yeah. The, like the, mini, the cheese department. Yeah, you get yeah, them, yeah. I love them. And then you spread it, and, 
and just be generous. I like everything. I love cheese, so especially cream cheese. So you make it really thick. And then you take your olives and you chop the olives and you crunch the bacon. The bacon needs to be really crispy. I don't like soggy bacon. I'm not no, who a does? fan. You know, you should always bake your bacon. Do you bake your bacon? No, I don't bake my bacon. You put your bacon on a slotted sheet pan, throw it in the oven, and cook the bacon until it's crisp. You don't have to flip it. The fat drips away. It doesn't make a mess of your stove. And the grease isn't up. everywhere. The yeah. grease isn't everywhere. It's perfect every time. 375, about 18 minutes. That's awesome. So then we have our olives. And then you take your crumbled bacon you and you spread it in all kinds of sticks you. because of the cream cheese. Yum. And there you go. Delicious. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm going back to the bowl. Anybody chime in? Okay. Okay. Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> if you were given a hall pass uh, by your spouse, who would you use it on? Your he spouse. Knows. Who would I use it on, Bill? She <laughs> likes the rock. Dwayne. Dwayne. Come on. Hi, Dwayne. <laughs> hey. John gets upset because I meet too many people that so are. So you can't say that. You can't say that. It's not They fair. end up coming over for supper. Who's yours? <laughs> my very first crush was Tom Jones, and I gotta say, oh I'm, my God. I'm still Tom he Jones totally, down. He would totally go for you, too. He's delicious. I love him. Can I just tell you my oh, Tom yeah. Jones story quickly? <laughs> We're, yep. in, we're in Las Vegas. This is when I worked out in L.A. I was doing my show out there. Let's go to Vegas for a week. Tom Jones is appearing at Caesars Palace. <laughs> and he was great. End of the show, he meets us in the lobby. We got the camera, a couple of cameras. I say to Tom Jones, I say, uh, Tom, my wife really, really likes you. <laughs> I did. It'd be Shocker. great. <laughs> It'd be great if when you, you meet her, give a little kiss on the, on the cheek. Sure, Regis, sure. So we start the little interview with him. <laughs> oh, oh, Tommy, I, I'd like you to meet my wife, Joy. You bring me in. I didn't... I bring you no. in. Whatever it was. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> they get in there, and Tom Jones grabs a hold of her. <laughs> and, and, and Billy, listen to me. She grabs a hold of him. <laughs> it's Tom Jones. Yes. And they're hugging, and they're kissing. Oh, they're not hugging. The lips to lips, John. Oh. I'm telling you. He, he dipped me. <laughs> I you know he's going to have it. You got dipped. And that's what I was saying. It. <laughs> it was terrible to look at as a husband. You know what I mean? I, know. I think that was a bad plan, Regis. Really. She's bad. enjoying it. She's loving it. And Regis is walking around. Well, okay, that's enough. Uh, no, but listening to me. You never did uh, that again, did you? Never did no, that again. She taught you. you she showed you. Tom you don't Jones. get a whole pass. No. I had mine. We won't ask you. <laughs> yes, we okay. won't ask you. Oh, my God, I'm so envious, Joy. <laughs> Okay. No, there's one thing I'd like to ask before we all leave. Earlier today, you guys said date night is Tuesday night. Yes. Yeah. What does date night mean to you? Um, it's fun. It's like we usually uh, go to like a happy hour and uh, <laughs> get it started, happy get the kids hour. out the way, and then we either go to a movie or go out to dinner. And so it's just us, you know what I mean? We try to make one day where it's just all about us having fun, like, you know, before we had the kids and That's stuff right. like that. So it's fun. That's right. yeah. Yeah. Because the kids, when you have kids, the kids are like full throttle football. Like, we got basketball, oh, we got dance, <laughs> sure. daddy, but I got... you're supposed yeah, to make it yeah. really exciting. Like, when we went and talked to someone, they were like, you should each plan a date night, and it should be very, like, you know, you're on the beach, you're this. It really boils down to sushi in a movie. It's not what you think. But we're supposed right, right, to be creative, like salsa dancing, doing something <laughs> you've never done. <laughs> it, we're like sushi in a movie. <clears throat> but, well, that's, yeah. It's a lot of effort. Yeah, it is very smart. All right. <laughs> it's very, very smart. smart. Now that we had a little bite, it's time to get our game on when we come back. We're going to do guy versus girl charade competition. The audience may win a special prize. Whoa. I'm joined by my husband, John. We've got Bill, we've got Regis, we've got Joy, we've got Christy. We're going to play guys versus girls charades. The ladies are playing for this half of the house. The gentlemen are playing for that half. Our staff has put together um, a bowl full of films, books, or television shows. Those are the only three categories. Okay. Films, book, or TV show. Each person on each team will go 30 seconds. The buzzer will sound when your 30 seconds is up. Of course, you cannot speak during your 30 seconds. And just so we're all square, film, book, or TV show. Got it. Okay? 
For 30 seconds on my clock, are you ready, team? Yes, we're, yes, ready. we're ready. I'm going to take the first 30, second 30. Got Troy, it. you're going to take us home. Oh, okay? Got, got it. it. <laughs> this is going to go. I'm like, yes, let's go. Okay. <laughs> Do not start that clock until after I read. Right. Give her a chance. <laughs> so just just do no, no, no. Okay, okay, okay. Start the clock. It's a TV show. Mm -hmm. Three words. words. I love Lucy. <laughs> um, the Good Wife. Um, we'll do something. Three words. Third <laughs> word. Third <laughs> Last word. Okay. Um, little, little kid. Small. Small baby. Girl. 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 Uh, love those. No, wait. Um, um, oh, girl. girl. No. That's two words. Two word girls. Um, uh, third, first word. The the word. The word. So the, the blank girls. The blank girls. The golden girls. Yeah. Oh my God! <laughs> do we get to see him? Do we guys hurry up and do okay. it? No, we can't. Ready? See it. Okay. Book. First word. word. First word. Forty. <laughs> Fifty. Fifty. Second grade. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, I didn't yeah. have to tell him how many words all together and then first one. We, we, he got it. Yeah, he we got it. Well. Okay, wait. <laughs> <laughs> did you hear me say 50 shakes of grace? No, I didn't know. I didn't think so. Oh, mine's hard. Can I pick another one? Sure, pass. What is this? <laughs> what is this? Okay. Holy cow. <laughs> That's good, Kristen. I'm proud of you for saying that. <laughs> They're both so hard. Uh, okay. To us. Okay. <laughs> okay. Movie. Movie. One word. word. Uh oh. Tired. Drunk. A drunk. Sleep. Hangover. The hangover. Hang. Psycho. Let's get up there. It's really oh, okay. okay. All right. Ready? Uh, no talking, though. Okay. It's hard for you. Okay, ready? <laughs> TV show. One Four. word. Heart. Love. Lovers. Love you. Love. I love you. One word? The whole show is one word. Three <laughs> words. Okay. <laughs> Important for me. The first word. I love, love you. I love Lucy. Thank you. Okay. Oh, it all comes down to enjoy. Oh, when you see this. Oh, Joy. Oh, my God. Let's go, Joy. I never saw yeah, this. Okay, ready? Ready. Um, no talking. Oh, wait a minute. Movie. Movie. Two, Two words. words. First, First word. Fight. 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 Oh, fight. 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 Give it up for Regis, everybody. Yeah. Yeah. Bring us home, baby. Bring us home, baby. Yeah, we're all charades at college. <laughs> yeah, Deb, what time is it? <laughs> Regis has to go. <laughs> Gotta grab some. Okay. I grab one of these. And then you wrap Don't stop that thing until I get you. And then look at your man. I heard you, boy. Whoa, did you tell? Look at your team and tell them what okay. it is. Look at these beautiful guys. Is it a book? Is it a movie? Is it oh, a... my God. To do the first thing. Yes. It's a TV, TV show. show. Two words. Hit, fight, strong, strong, uh, badman, box, boxing, constipation. Eight, Eight seven, let's let's six, show. stop, 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 The Sopranos. Oh. You guys were never going to get that How would you say Sopranos? That's a tough one. <laughs> Singing Sopranos. Well, that's a tough one. Forget All right. Oh, that is oh, a This half yeah. of the audience, guess what you're all getting? Oh. oh, come on. Do you really think I would do that? Everybody's getting these. Uh.
we've had maybe a few more moments than you guys and more cocktails, certainly. We wanted to make sure everybody here gets to go out and continue to have fun with their day. You guys are all getting the New York City Pass. It's a booklet of tickets. It includes admission to the top six attractions here in New York City, including the Empire State Building Ob Observation Deck, the American Museum of Natural History, the Metropolitan Museum of Art, the MoMA, and the Statue of Liberty, and more. They're available in 11 different North American cities, and they even help you guys skip all the lines. <laughs> the booklet is valued at over 100 bucks each. So tuck it neatly in your bag before you leave. Tom's gotta go backstage to meet up with the band. These guys are gonna get their seats for our big show. I'll meet you in a